Hello everyone, I am Audrey and this is Angel Gala Behind the Scenes. Welcome to a new episode. Today I have my very good friend Christina Bodotsky with me. Hi Tina. Hi Audrey. Thanks for being here. You know the entire history and journey about the Angel Gala. We've been friends and good friends for a long time. In fact, we are both from Hungary and we met here at the Broadmoor way back when. You have helped us in very many different ways and you have been a guest before as well. It was an honor to help Audrey and actually see this entire journey, how she started the Angel Gala and how this whole idea of the fundraising came to light back, you know, seven, eight years ago. Of course, we have known Emma since she was born and then I remember when she first performed on the first Angel Gala. One year I was able to come and help uh, the kids room so that was a very nice experience behind the scenes I was able to see what actually Audrey does here. You know when you came that was like a very special help because we had had this idea of having the angel families and the angel moms um, being involved and being able to attend the gala so some have younger children and then so we have this children's room where the kids come in they also dress up and they can also come to the gala but they have their own room with their own activities and one year you were helping us and you were watching all the kids in there so that was really really um, helpful and meaningful and of course years later you also came and attended as a guest with your husband and also with your sister and her husband. That was a year when Emma performed again and she was nine, I believe, and then she did this special dance to honor her dad and that was really meaningful for me and all of us for, for you all to come. How was the event from the other side when you attended as a guest? It was just a very special feeling and it really touches your heart. Like really seeing those children you know on stage and just performing whatever they pick to do it helped Emma as well for so many years with her dance and right. you know coping with her loss talking about um, Clint and talking about your family and how you went through everything and how you became part of Angels of America's Fallen and now you're the chair of the gala and now your company's sponsoring it. It touches your heart a lot. And of course we enjoyed the beautiful meal and it was, you know, a beautiful, you know, dress up black tie event. I remember I actually got a dance camp for one of my daughters at the gala. So that was really That's nice right. too. Thank you, Tina, for supporting in so many different ways. You know, you didn't only help with like the whole logistics and in the kids room, but then you came and supported as a guest and then also the silent auctions since you're in the industry and in the hospitality and event business as well. Um, thank you so much for being a part of that. It comes naturally since I work here at the Broadmoor so that's why I was able to be part of the event from the very beginning and I worked the function even if I wasn't here volunteering or helping. Right. I was able to be here from the hotel side and helping with the event or bartending or helping right. with the banquet team. We basically mentioned all the different ways that you can get involved and support if you're watching. If you haven't heard of Angels of America's Fallen before, please check it out. The next one is June 11th of 2022 at the Broadmoor. This is Angel Gala Behind the Scenes presented by Lux and Love. And thank you so much for watching and see you at the next episode. Bye! Bye.